Hello, class. Hello, can you hear me? Hello? Hello, good evening. Good evening, how are you? Good, and you? I'm good. I'm happy to see. Um, well, uh, not everybody because I don't see everybody, but I'm happy to be with you guys. <laughs> Ah, okay. How are you? Very good. How are you? Pretty good? Nelson? Good. Good. Yeah. Excellent. All right. I like that. I like that. Excellent. Okay. Very Excellent. Good. Okay. It's the middle of the week, so we have to be great. <laughs> Okay. All right, hello, Olga. Hello, teacher. Good how evening. Are, good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. Good. Okay. And you? I'm good. I'm not bad at all. Okay. Yeah. Um, all right, hello, Jorge. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, how are you? Pretty good, thank you. Yeah. All right. you. Excellent, I'm glad to hear that. Okay, hello Carolina. Ah, she's nuts. Okay, hello Carolina. Hi teacher, good evening. Oh, good evening, how are you? Um, más o menos. Más o menos. Oh. Sí. Es uno de esos días. Uh -huh. mm. Sorry to hear that. Ok, bueno. Pero gracias por conectarse. A pesar de que no es el mejor de los días, ¿verdad? Gracias. No, te chera usted. Um, all right. Hello, Tatiana. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Fine. Good. Glad to hear that. And you, how are you? Not bad. Not bad at all. Um, yeah. I'm happy that it's the middle of the week. We're Me too. <laughs> I like almost it. vacation. <laughs> yes, almost vacation. So I still have to work, but but at least um you know at night I will be off. <laughs> so that will be <laughs> something. To, yeah, exactly. Okay, um, Suleima, hello. Suleima, do you are you there? Yes. Okay. Good, good. I'm here. Excellent. How how are you feeling? Are you feeling better? Yes. Yeah. Yes, teacher. Good, good. I'm glad to hear that. Excellent. Thanks. Okay. Good. Okay. So I'm going to start with attendance. Um, and uh, we have Christina. Christina is not here, right? What about um, Annie? Is Annie here? No, no Annie. Okay. Um, what about uh, Mari? No Mari. Carolina? Present teacher. Okay, very good. Welcome Carolina. And Christy? No, no Christy. Okay. Jorge? Present teacher. All right, welcome. And 
Karen. Karen. Not here, Karen, okay. Um, Karina? Present. Welcome, Karina. Leonardo? Present, teacher. Welcome, Leonardo. Linda? Linda? No, Linda. Marlene? Okay. Miguel? Miguel? Nelson G? Present. All right. Welcome, Nelson. And what about... Thank Nelson? you. You're welcome. And what about Nelson A? Present teacher. All right. Welcome. We've missed you. We're happy you're back. And Norma. No, no Norma. And Olga? Present teacher. All right, welcome, Olga. Thank you. Omar. No, Omar. Okay. Uh, Suleyma Rodriguez. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Suleyma Melgar. Suleyma Melgar. Okay. And uh, Tatiana. Present. Okay, very good. I'm going to call out the names again, just to make sure that I haven't missed anybody. Um, Cristina, Annie, Mari, Christy, Karen, Linda, Marlene, Miguel, Norma, Omar, Present teacher. Ah. Okay. Welcome, Norma. Thank you, teacher. All right. Very good. All right. So I have. I I think I haven't missed anybody. Excellent. Okay. Very good. Um. Just a second. One moment. Hello, good evening. Which is the schedule for the next week? Um Sir, I couldn't hear you very well. Could you repeat the question? Hmm. Uh, I think, Jorge, there's a, um, yeah. Okay, so he left. <laughs> yeah, I think he was having internet problems. Okay. Um, all right, so what we're going to do is um, start with our PowerPoint presentation. Tell me if you can see the PowerPoint, please. Tell me when you can see it. Oops. Please. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay. Good. Just give me a moment because I don't know how to get out of here. Ah, here it is. Okay. I see. All right. So indirect questions, um, yes or no. Okay. That's what we're going to be looking at today. Okay. This is a new unit, unit, th unit three. We're looking at unit three. It's uh, your facilitator is Jessica Guerrero. It's intermediate two and it's class number 17. Okay, so let's start. So we have, uh, so let's practice the conversation. 
Um, okay, so first of all, we have some questions here. What does prototype mean? Uh, hold on, just give me a moment. Just give me one second, guys. Solo quiero asegurarme de algo. Por cierto, chicos, um, les recuerdo también de que uh, están bienvenidos para empezar ahí con el final exam también. No tienen que esperar hasta la última semana para hacer el final. Lo del final pueden ya desde ahorita empezar porque el final eh, va con la unidad 3, 4. Entonces ya hasta ahorita también pueden empezar a hacer eso. Ok, para que no se vayan atrasando. Ok, alguna preguntita? No, teacher. Ok. I have a question, teacher, about the the schedule for the next week. Oh, good, good, Jorge, you're back. Okay, good. Yes, tell us, what is your question? Uh, the question is, which is the schedule for the next week? Is this a vacation for everybody? Or? The schedule is zero class. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, so, uh, yes. Um, Enjoy. Just a question. Just a question because I have to work Monday and Tuesday. Ah, oh, yes, yes, I understand. Yeah, so enjoy, enjy your your free nights, right? So Monday and Tuesday you have free nights, and then I guess okay. after that you have complete vacation. Okay? okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. All right. Any other questions that you guys have? Okay, all right, so let's share the presentation again. Okay, so I have, I have these um, three questions. First question, what, to, what does prototype mean? What type of new products, in your opinion, require the building of a prototype before mass production? Does your company make use of prototypes? Do we understand these questions? Yes, teacher. Okay. I'm going to do this because I don't want you to pay attention to this. I want you to pay attention to this. Okay? So are these questions clear for you? Yes, teacher. Yeah? Okay, good. So what we're gonna do is I'm going to get you to work in pairs. You're gonna be discussing these questions, okay? And I'll give you about five minutes to discuss it. Of course, we're gonna be working in breakout rooms. Um, Um, so I'm going to give you five minutes. Any questions so far? We understand what we're going to be doing. So remember, you're only discussing those three questions. No reading, conversation, nothing. Okay, just three questions. That's it. All right. Sounds good? Sounds good. All right. All right. So let's open the rooms. Teacher, oh. puede compartir la pregunta. Yo no la logré tomar. Quiero ver si puedo. They're in the manual, but I can share them. Oh, 
I'm good. Ahorita, ahorita. Ya, yeah, teacher. Ok. O no responder nada más, pero dar las preguntas. That's right. Uh -huh. Ok. Okay. Uh, what does prototype mean? A uh, new bicycle model, I think. Okay. In my case. The, uh, prototype or the other product or this conversation? Read the conversation better. No, 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 no. Reading, no reading the conversation. Just okay. Oh, okay. Just discussing the questions. Okay? okay. Don't pay attention to the conversation right now. Okay. Um, Hi, Nelson. Hi, teacher. What happened to your partner? I don't know. Maybe, you know. Entró? No, salió. Nunca entró. Sí, estaba acá, pero creo que se salió. Ok, va, le voy a dar entonces una nueva, eh, una, una nueva pareja, ok? Aquí okay. voy a leer. No. No, en mi caso no. In my case, no. Okay. Only that. Only that. Thank you, Karina. Are you girls finished? Yeah, yes. Yes. Okay. We finished. All right. Great. Sería para before mass production. Mhm. Okay. Mhm. Mm example: make example of chairs or tables or beds. In my, in my company. Okay. Y en the prototype uh, present in a conference in a, in a place? And yes, and the chief of production when a daughter uh, uh, carpintero, no sé cómo se dice. Con another uh, person because uh, made the, uh, the different uh, medidas, measure. 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 Okay. And say she is actable for for adult or child. The furniture is uh, for child too. And the medication is a specific. Is measure. Is measure. Measurement. Measure. 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 Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I understand that uh, the carpenter make the, the the furniture and your boss see yes. the project. Decide to wear, to wear the of the car, carpenters the measure okay. of the different furniture in my work. Okay. In my case, no. <laughs> Only money. Yes. <laughs> in uh, in the future, uh, the, my company say buy no. My company buy uh, um buy by house in case um, we make a, a one house for the customers and they can they can see the the, the new house Yes. Es decir, eh, a futuro. Okay. All right, we ready? Yeah? Okay, so tell me, what does prototype mean? <coughs> yes? Could you repeat, please? Of course. What does prototype mean? It's a model of the product. A model of the product. Um, can you be a little bit more elaborate? Um, is creating or is create your idea to, to make tangible the product. Okay, very good. Excellent, excellent, very good. Okay, another another idea? Uh, Me. Uh, yes, okay. morning. Is, uh, a prototype is an early sample model or relays of a product build to test a concept or process. Okay, very good. Me, teacher. Yes, Carolina. It is simple of the product to be manufactured or elaborate, elaborated. Elaborated. Ah, uh, elaborated. Okay, very good. Okay, excellent. Any other ideas that you want to share? Teacher. Yeah. It's an original model of which something is pattern. 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 Yeah, exactly. Very good. Yeah. All of everything that you guys have said, right on. Okay. Very good. So basically, you have the product, right, in your mind. But 
you have to create a product. You have to create it. You have to make the model, right? But this is not for mass production, right? You're not creating to sell it. It's just so that people are able to see it, um, touch it, smell it, whatever it is that you need to do with it, okay? Um, so it, it basically, it's like the first, the first um, samples of the product, okay? That's what it is. Okay, very good. Next question uh, that we had was, what type of new products in your opinion require the building of a prototype before mass production? What kind of products? Uh, in my opinion, uh, the tapes uh, for the technology product. For technological products, okay, all right, like what? Can you give me examples? Can you give me any examples? Uh, the cell phone, for example. Okay, very good, a cell phone. Mm -hmm. A computer. A computer. A robot. A robot. A robot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Anything else? Uh, sure. It's a car. A car. A panel. Uh, yes. Mm hmm. Yeah. Very good. Okay. All right. Anything else? In my opinion. The full, the, the new full is necessary. Uh, make a prototype. Okay. Prototype. A new dish. A new Teacher. Dish. Yes. I, I think there are a lot of product that requires the building of, of a pro, prototype. Yeah. But I, yeah. I imagine there are a condition to to, to require this prototype. Maybe is when the product need to be tangible, tangible. Yes, very good. Absolutely, when it needs to be tangible, absolutely. Okay, very good. Does your company make use of prototypes? I think, yes. Yes? What, what do you make prototypes of? Sorry, repeat, please. What do you make prototypes of? Your company, what do you make prototypes types of? In my opinion, no. Our business is to provide a service um, not production. Okay. Okay. Right. I'm, I'm kind of confused. Mm -hmm. uh, when you, uh, in, the, in the question, talk about the comp the, your company, but right. it's, it's about the, the product that we, we create in the class in the class no, before. No, 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 your company, the one that you work for. For example, oh, okay. Carolina says in my company, it, there's no prototype because it's a service. In my company okay. as well, right? Um, Inglés Corporativo does not make a product. They may they give a service, so I can't have a prototype. Okay, then in my case, I think in one occasion could be necessary to be to to make a prototype okay um what what kind of prototype yeah in my case maybe uh, could be a, a small house for for example a small house 
Okay, so you're you're in construction. That's your job. Civil engineering. You're a civil engineer. Ah, okay, yes. All right, so deaf. Okay, sounds good. Mm -hmm. What about the rest of you guys? Do you have any prototypes in your in your in your workplace? In my company, don't make a product. They don't make products. No. Okay. In my company, actually, is a financial company. Finance. But in finance. Uh, but in two years, uh, we we building a model house because say house. Mm -hmm. Okay. All okay. Right. Uh, we don't know you say prototype. Uh, okay. We don't know. No, we don't know how many to for a product. We we are a computer seller. Okay. Uh, okay, very good, excellent. Um, okay, so guys, remember the pronunciation of this word is prototype. Can you repeat that after me? Prototype. 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 Good. Prototype. So it's not. It's not um, proto. It's not proto. Ah. It's proto. Prototype. 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 And then the last part is type, not T. Type. It's type. Prototype. Proto. Prototype. 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 Yeah. Prototype. Very okay. good. Okay. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Okay, class, um, excellent. So now we're going to be paying attention to the conversation, I see. Okay, so the conversation says, Tom and Diana are discussing ideas to begin prototyping a new bicycle model. Uh, read the conversation, take turns practicing. So right now, as we usually do, I need you to turn off your microphone because uh, we're going coma, to cuchillo, coma. Come, mi amor, come. Um, so we need to turn off the microphones um, because you're going to be practicing after me. And I need you guys to not interrupt each other, right? So, all right, so here we go. The accelerator has green light. To be produced. Now, we need to work on the prototype. Great. I think our best choice is to hire steel masters so they build a good prototype to help us spot any flaw we haven't identified in the design. I agree, Tom. The prototype will help our manufacturers to be very accurate with the design of the handlebars, the frame, and the saddle. 
which are the innovative features of the accelerator. Good point. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. Totally. Then I'll work on the sketch of the parts. And you might want to start with the description and spec sorry and specifications of each so steel masters start working all right all right, that's it. Okay, so as usual, I wanna know if I can help you with any vocabulary. So you can write in the chat any words that you want me to uh, help you with the pronunciation. Let's start with pronunciation first. Okay, I think I have all the words. Did I miss anything? Is there? Okay. 
All right, let's let, let's take the first one. Uh, now you can open up your microphone because I do want to hear how you pronounce it. Okay, so open up your microphone. I want to hear you guys. So everybody, open up the microphone. Okay, here we go. Accelerator. 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 The stress is on the second syllable. Accelerator. 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 Mm -hmm. Accelerator. No. Accelerator. Accelerator. <laughs> Accelerator. Listen to how many syllables. Accelerator. That's five. Accelerator. 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 Not the later. Later. Accelerator. 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 Yes. Very good. Very good. I see. I see. Okay, next. Higher. 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 This is uh Higher. it's uh Higher. It's Higher. this word is the same as um like it's a, a it's a um it's called a homophone for the word. Higher, 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 higher. You pronounce the same. Higher, higher, the same. Higher, higher, higher. Yes. Higher. Good. Next. Accurate. 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 No. No, accurate. 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 Mm -hmm. accurate. 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 Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. Innovative. Oh, no, sorry, sorry, sorry. I missed this one. Saddle. 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 Innovative. 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 Totally. Totally. Innovative. Totally. 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 Catch. 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 Hey, los felicito. No, no, no me están diciendo a sketch. Very good. Very good. It's just sketch. Mm -hmm. Sketch. All right. Very good. All right, now give me um, the vocabulary that you don't know the meaning. Put it in the chat. Okay. Una nueva titular de la mujer que le 
So remember, this is the meaning. We're looking at, you guys don't understand the meaning of something? Mm -hmm. Can't find the word my oh yeah, found it. Did I get all the words? Yeah, all the words? Okay, so the first word is accelerator. Accelerator is just the name of the product. Okay, it's just the name. All right, so the, it's just the name that they gave, they decided to give the product. Okay, hire means to give a job to somebody. Okay, so um, if you don't have a job, you go to interviews, and at the interview, they may hire you. It means that they will give you a job. Okay? How do you say, how do you say hire in Spanish? Contratado. Right. Contratar. 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 Yeah. Steel Masters is just the name of the place. Steel Masters. Uh... Okay. The company is like the company. The company. Mm -hmm. Okay. Got it? Okay. Yes. Good. Spot. Spot means. Uh, yeah, exactly. It means to identify. Spot means to identify. Identificado. Mm -hmm. Flaw means an imperfection. An imperfection. Detectar un, algún error. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then we have saddle. Saddle is like in a bicycle. The saddle is the place where you sit on the bicycle. That's the saddle. So where where you put your bottom um, and you sit on the bicycle that that part there is called the saddle okay does that make sense mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. do we understand saddle yes no teacher could you repeat okay in a bicycle the place where you sit, that's the saddle. Okay. Yeah. This is the location. The thing, the thing. Mm, it's like a bar of, of... El asiento, where you, where the bicycle, mm, okay. that's the saddle. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. Might it means maybe. 
possibility. Okay. Okay. Okay, good. All right. So what we're going to do as usual, we're going to um, put you guys into pairs and to conversation between the Diana and Tom. First time you will be Diana, the second time you will be Tom. Okay, so you're going to take turns practicing this conversation. Okay, and after you practice the conversation, you're going to be discussing these three questions. What are two reasons Diana and Tom mentioned to build a, a prototype of the accelerator? What are the distinctive features of the new product? And what two tasks would Diana and Tom do before ordering the prototype to Steel Masters? Okay. Do we understand? Pretty clear? Yes? No? Yes? It's clear? Uh, teacher, I understand. We have to read the conversation and then talk about the the three questions. The three questions, exactly. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Good. Let's start. Um, okay. I'm going to put you back into your original groups. Here we go. Just I'm going to give you a little bit more time. Give you about eight minutes practice the conversation and then discuss the answers. So they, so they will build a good pro, 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 prototype to help us, but any flow we haven't identified in the design. I agree, Tom. The prototype will help our manufacturers to be very accurate, accurate with the design of the handle bars, uh, the frame and the Saddle, which are the innovative features of the accelerator. Good point. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. Totally. Then I'll work on the catch of the parts and you might want to start with the des description and a specification of each. So a steel master start working. All right. Okay, now I'm Diane. Okay. The accelerator has green light to be produced. Now we need to work on the prototype. Great. I think our best choice is to hire a steel masters so they build a good prototype to help us spot any flaw we haven't identified in the design. I agree, Tom. The prototype will help our manufacturers to be very accurate with accurate with the design of the handlebars 
the frame and the cellar, cellar which are the inno, innovative feature of the accelerator. Good point. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. Totally. Then I'll work on the sketch of the part. And you may want to start with, with the description and the specification of each. So still master start working. All right. Okay, now response the question. What are the reasons Diana and Tom mentioned to build a prototype of the celebrity? Mm -hmm. What are the reasons? Mm -hmm. Help. Help mm -hmm. they to spot any flaw that, mm -hmm. that they haven't identified. Sport. Mm, yeah. Mm -hmm. And we all help help the the manufacturers to be very accurate accurate with the design of the handlebars. The frame and the shadow. I think distinctive feature. Mm. I think only that are are the reason the two reason. What is the reason? Um, only when Tom said uh, build a good prototype to help us spot any flaw we haven't even identified in the design. And the other one, when Diana said the prototype will help, help our manufacturers to be very accurate, accurate with the design of the handle, the bar, the frame, and the saddle, etc. The prototype will help manufacturers to be very accurate with the design of the handlebars. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. The other question: What, what are the distinct features of the new product? Of the, in the prototype to mm -hmm. main to, to build a prototype of the ex el ¿cómo me dijo que se pronuncia? El el Okay. Veamos. Mm. Veamos la respuesta. Será este donde dice head, head up, spont, que dice Tom en, en la segunda, que dice head up, spont, um, ajá. Great, Tiene our best choice. Uh -huh. Yes, my okay. opinion is correct. Es que allí como que dice el que le va a ayudar, ¿verdad? A identificar. Porque como dice aquí. Lo que dice es como que. Ella dice como que hay que trabajar un prototipo de. De, de que les ayude a trabajar. Entonces él dice, oh, qué buena idea. Ajá. Para falsear, como decimos nosotros. Qué excelente idea has tenido. Ah, pero yo creo que dice la pregunta dice what. Ah, ¿cuál es la razón? Entonces, 
no es la razón. Donde dice que, ajá, eso, head or manufactory. Ok, dejemos esa la number one. Ya lo tengo. Es uh -huh. la donde dice. Después de hay de, Grayton. De de pro, 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 ah. es, yes. Pero uh, try will help our manufacturing to be very acquired. Acquire with to decide the hard bar. Uh -huh. Si no, no va a corregir la ticha. Ok. You need me to correct. Ah, ok. Hola, ticha. Hello. <laughs> Teacher, ahora me toca a mí 10 minutos. ¿Cómo? Perdón, no le escuché. Can you repeat? Ahora me toca the section, the section 10 minutes for you. Why? Ahora me toca. Ah, ah. Ahora me toca okay, los 10 okay, minutos okay. con, con oh, su persona. Sí, sí. sí. Um, okay. mm, déjeme revisar. Um, Yes, yes, you're right. Mm -hmm. Sí, hoy, hoy le toca. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, any questions? Yes. No, no teacher. No? Thank you. Okay. Uh, number two. Um, we have the manufacturer to be very accurate. With design, design. Accurate. 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 Yes, correct. Mm -hmm. Thank you. The second question, what are the dis distinctive future of the new product? Um, our handler bars, the frame and the saddle. Mm -hmm. And the third question was to task with Diana and Tom do before ordering the prototype to still master. Uh, we work on the, no, they work on the sketch of part. And my want to start with the description and a specification of each part. Okay, uh, practice the conversation. Okay. Okay. The accelerator has green light to be produced. Now, we need to work on the proto prototype. Great. I think our best choice is to hire a steel master so they build a good prototype to help us spot any flaw. We haven't identified in the design. I agree. The prototype will help our manufacturing manufacturers to be very accurate with the design of the handlebars, the frame, and the saddle, which are the innovative future of the accelerator. Good point. In addition, the prototype will ensure communication is clear. They will know exactly what we want. Totally. Uh, then I 
idle word on the sketch of the verb. And you might want to start with the description and the specification of each. So still master, start working. All right. Okay. Um, um, Diana, no, switch. Okay. okay. The accelerator has green light to be produced now we need to work on the prototype. Great. I think our best choice is to hire a steel master so they build a good prototype to help us spot and plow we haven't identified. Okay. All right. Any problems with the pronunciation? Any questions that you guys have? Problem. No problem. No problems? No? No, teacher. Okay. Great. All right. So we are going to... Um, check the answers to the questions. But before we do that, I'm going to be taking attendance. Okay, so we'll start with that first. Um, okay, so Christina? Yes, thank you too. Oh, welcome. And uh, Ani? Present teacher. <clears throat> All right, welcome. Mari? Mari, no Mari. Eh, Carolina, present. Christy, 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 no Christy. Okay, Jorge, present teacher. All right, um, Karen, Karen. Karina? Present. Leonardo? Present teacher. Linda? Present teacher. Welcome, Linda. Marlene? Present. Welcome, Marlene. Miguel? 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 Miguel Angel? Hello? Hmm. Quizás algo le ha pasado. Tal vez me puede decir. Miguel Ángel? Ok. Um, Nelson G. Present. Nelson A. Present teacher. Ok. Norma. Present teacher. Great. Olga. Present. Omar. Present. Welcome, Omar. Suleyma Rodriguez. Present, did you? Okay, good. Suleyma Melgar. Present, did you? Welcome, Suleyma and Tatiana. Present. All right, very good. So I, the people I didn't hear were Mari, Christy, and Karen. Everybody else is here. Yeah, okay, good. All right, so what we're gonna do now is um, 
check the answers for the questions. First question, what are two reasons Diana and Tom mentioned to build a prototype of the accelerator? What are the two reasons? The first one is to, to help us spot any flaw. Good. We have identified in the design. Okay, good. So help us spot any flaws. Good. Another reason? Uh, we'll help our manufacturers to be very accurate. Very good. Excellent. That's the two reasons. So first, it's going to help us spot any flaws. And second, it will help our manufacturers to be very accurate. Excellent. What are the distinctive features of the new product? Mm -hmm. What the are the frame, the frame and the saddle? Yes, very good. The frame and the saddle. And what else? What's the other thing? The handlebar. Yeah, it's basically it's not just the handlebar; it's the design of the handlebars and of the frame and the saddle. Yeah, okay, so it's all the design of those three things, of the handlebars, the frame, and the saddle. And last question, what two tasks will Diana and Tom do before order, ordering the prototype to Skill Masters? Mm -hmm. Work on the sketch of the park. Okay, so first we're going to be um, doing the sketch of the park. What else? Um, um, to start with the descri description and the specification of each. Good. Okay, so the descript description and specifications of each. Those are the two things. All right, very good. Any questions? No? Okay. So in that case, uh, we are going to move on to the next part. We're going to be looking at some vocabulary here. Um, this vocabulary has to do with, cre um, what's the word? Uh, mm. oh, um, Oh my goodness, the word has escaped my mind. Um, Direct? No. Mm. Ah. I mean, no, the verdad que se me escapado. Okay, basically, like putting together, let's say there's a specific word I've got. Uh, right now, it's basically the idea is to putting together uh, the, the product, okay? So when we've, we've gone past the design of the product, now we're actually going to put the, the, the product together. So we have vocabulary there. Um, all of these, the four words here are verbs, okay? So let's make sure we understand this. this these are all verbs, okay? Oops. Okay, so weld is a verb. Okay, screw is another verb. Okay, tighten is also referring to a verb. Okay. And adjust. Is also referring to a new verb. Okay. 
Now, the only one that is not a verb is this one. So don't get it confused. This one's actually not referring to verb, it's referring to a noun. Okay. All right, so what we're gonna do, just like yesterday, we're going to be matching the meaning of the words right here with the actual vocabulary. Okay, so go ahead, try to, this, we're gonna do this individually. Let's work individually. Okay, are you guys finished? No, teacher. No? No, yet. I'll give you more time, no worries. Okay, you're ready now?
Yes. Do you need more time? Ready. Anybody need more time? No? Okay. All right, let's start. Let's start with the first one. Weld. Which one would it be which which one would it be weld? Is to join two pieces of metal or plastic. Metal. Okay, very good. To join two pieces of metal or plastic by heating so the edges come together. Okay. Um, how do you say weld in Spanish? Soldar. 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 Excellent. Mm -hmm. Next, which one is screw, the verb? A point, a point piece of metal with a twist part on it called trim. Remember, this one is the verb. Sure, to attach one surfer to another uh -huh. using a screw. Exactly. Very good. What is a screw? Mm -hmm. Or better said, what is to screw then? A tornilla. A tornilla. Yeah. Excellent. Okay. Next, we have Titan. Tighten. To turn an object as a screw until it's tight and cannot be turned anymore. Excellent. Very good. All right. So um, how do you say this in Spanish? Ajustar. Ajustar. Tighten. Deshacer. No. Apretar, teacher. Apretar, apretar. apretar. Very good. Apretar. Turn an object as a screw until it's tight and it cannot um, be turned anymore. So tighten. Apretar. Okay. Apretar. Mm -hmm. Pero apretar no de apretar. No es tipo de apretar. Sino que apretar como de estar apretando un. un como enroscar. Como enroscar. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, adjust. Adjust. Mm -hmm. Move an object mm -hmm. slightly so oh. that is in the right so place. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Better. Right. So that it fits better. How do you spell? Mm -hmm. how do you, sorry. How do you say mm -hmm. adjust in Spanish? This one should be. Acomodar, ajustar. 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 Yes, exactly. Very good. Next one, a screw. A pointer piece of metal with a twister, twister part on the collar, there's in test of eating with a hammer to push and throw in order to fasten piece of metal of wood together. Very good. So screw is the piece of metal that holds the things together. So how do you say a screw in Spanish? Un tornillo. Un tornillo. Mm -hmm. Very good. All right. Any questions so far? Okay. All right. Let's check. The, go for the next one then. Then the um, next slide. We're going to be practicing a conversation. But before we practice the conversation, let's discuss this question. Does your company manufacture products? Are production processes updated frequently? 
Is there a quality okay. control department at your company? We understand these questions. So the questions are clear? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes. Once again, I don't want you to pay attention to the quest to the conversation, only these questions. I'm gonna put you into um, pairs again. I'm gonna change your partner so that you're not working with the same partner. And I'm going to get you to discuss these questions. Um, Hmm. Is your company manufacturable? No. Okay, so I'm gonna open up the breakout rooms so you can have five minutes to discuss. Here we go. Teacher, the number page. Sorry? Number page. Number of the página. Um, no está en... Uh, 27. 27. Yeah, 27. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Um. We work in the exercise one. Is this um, conversation, the practice is conversation? Luego respondemos preguntas. Okay. Okay. I am Lucia. Empiezo. I wonder if okay. you I wonder if you receive a copy of the analysis for the production process. I I have thank you. Uh, I have, thank you, you, Lucia. Perfect. I would like us to receive the steps of verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. So I, I, like, I like to now in the quality Control if step show we repeat once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point, Drell. Marta, would you mind telling us if the cost of the cost to run a second quality quality control will 
go very high? Of course, let me res, res, revise my pie. Mm -hmm. Well, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Okay. Ahora el inverso. Empiezo yo. Okay. I, go, I wonder if you recite a copy of the anal analysis for the production process. I have. Thank you. I have. Thank you, Lucia. Administrativos y programáticos, algo así. Frequently, my company does frequently. Processes update. Yes. Y is there a quality control department in your company? And there is quality control specialist, specialist um, person. Que tenemos una persona que es especialista en, en control de calidad, digamos. Ok. No sé si me entendió o no. Bueno, ahí decimos que estamos. Good. Did you finish? Okay, great. I'll see you in the main room. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, Norma. Thank you, Slim. Okay, all right. Um, I hope you had an opportunity there to answer the question. Remember, it was the questions and not the conversation. We weren't practicing the conversation. We were doing the questions. Okay, so um, okay. So the first question is. Um, hold on. First question. Does your company manufacture products? Oh, no, no, I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah, does your pro um, company manufacture products or no? In my company, no. In your company, no? no? My company, no. No? My company, no teach. No, okay. Is it is an NGO? Ah, okay, it's an NGO. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, very good. Do, what what is an NGO? Do you know? And don't tell me in Spanish. You guys know what an NGO is? ONG. Yeah, that's in Spanish, but I want it in English. What is an NGO? Um, head, head, o sea, ayuda comunitaria. In English, in English. Remember, okay. we're learning English, so we need to practice English. Head, comunitari, and children. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, good. All right, an NGO stands for non-governmental organization. Okay, I put in the chat, non-governmental organization. Okay, so it's an organization that helps people, but they don't have help from the government. They have their own funds. Okay. Sounds good? Yes, teacher, thank you. Yeah? Okay, good. Um, all right. Um, so nobody, nobody's company makes any products? Do you manufacture any products at all in your company? No? Okay, so I guess then the, this, the second question doesn't really apply. Are production processes updated frequently? Yes, no? I guess we, well, if, if there's no production of, if you, don't, if you don't manufacture products then you can't update any process. Okay, so we'll skip that one. Next question, is there a quality control department at your company? No, teacher. No? Don't make a product. No, not at all? No, but no. you know, it, you don't have to make a product to have quality control. So is there, is there a quality control department at your company? No, no. No? Nobody has a quality control department in your company? Yes, teacher. In my in my company, there are a, a quality control department. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. So good. they they check the quality of the material, mm -hmm. the materials, mm -hmm. and check the the advance of the of the of the building or or something. Right. Okay. Good. Exactly. Excellent. So you don't have to make a product to have quality control, right? Okay. So, um, hold on, guys. Oh my goodness, my, my cell phone went crazy. It's off. Sorry, guys. <laughs> my, my cell phone went crazy. Estaba, estaba apagado, pero de repente se activó. Está aprendiendo a cocinar, teacher. ¿Ah? <ríe> Está aprendiendo a cocinar. Ah, no, pero ¿qué le pasa a este celular? Es que lo que pasa, bueno, en realidad sí sé, um, está como topado de memoria, entonces ya no funciona bien, como que ya, ya todos los, los, de repente, no, no. Uh, no, o sea, digamos, um, hace cosas que no uno no le dice y, y no hace lo que uno le dice. <laughs> Entonces, maybe, no, no. maybe artificial intelligence, artificial. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, because sometimes I'm pressing something and nada. And then. Está como un adolescente, entonces. Ah, uh, algo así. <laughs> algo así, que no, no escucha. <laughs> ok. All right, guys. Um, where were we? Oh, okay. All right. Um, good. So we have discussed those questions. What we're going to do now, um, now that we have discussed the questions, we're going to uh, we're going to practice the conversation. If you notice, um, okay. So we have here. Three managers are in a meeting to discuss the production product of a new shampoo. Read the conversation, take turns practicing. Okay, so again, turn off your microphone. We're gonna be practicing the conversation, but by yourself at home. 
Here we go. I wonder if you received a copy of the analysis for the production process. Notice this is production, not, it's not, uh, it's not production, it's production, product. I have, thank you. Perfect. I'd like us to revise. The steps to verify. That we are ready to start. Producing our new shampoo. Right. I'd like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point, Craig. Martha, would you mind telling us if the cost to run A second quality control will go very high. Of course. Let me revise my files. Greg, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. All right, any questions? Okay, all right, we're going to put you again with your, with your group, uh, with your partner, and I want you to practice this conversation and after you practice the conversation, you can discuss these questions, these three questions. What is the new pro, uh, product uh, Lucia, Martha, and Greg are discussing about? What are two steps of the production process they, they mentioned in the conversation? And what did Greg suggest about the production process? Okay, so actually i just remember i can't put you with the same partner that before because this is going to be a group of three people because there are three people in this conversation okay so um okay do we understand what to do And of course, you're going to be changed. You're going to be taking turns, right? 
So one time you can be um, Lucia, another time you can be Martha, another time you can be Greg and so on, okay? Sounds good? Yes? Ready? Yes. Okay, here we go. Let's open up the rooms. Hello. Hello. What's up, Jorge? Nothing happened, teacher. Hmm. It's good, I don't. Yes, nothing that. <laughs> okay. But well, I'll try another group. ¿Qué pasó? All the groups are complete. Ya, Maybe. ya los comé. Hold on. Right, let's try again. Vamos a hacerlo una vez más. Hoy sí. Uh, not yet. Ya está asignado. Ok, I suggest you go out and come back in. Porque si no, porque ya lo he asignado tres veces. Go out of the, mm -hmm. the group. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Okay, so I am Greg. Okay, Christina is smart. I wonder if you received a copy of the analysis for the production process. I have, thank you. I have, thank you, Lucia. Perfect. I like us to revise the step to verify that we are ready to start producing, producing our new shampoo. Right. I'd like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point, Greg. Marta, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will go very high? Of course, let me revise my file. Uh, Greg, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Okay, now the question. What is the new product you see Marta and Greg are discussing about? The new product, shampoo. Yeah. Uh, yes. 
A new shampoo. Mm -hmm. A new shampoo. Number two. What are two steps of the production process to maintain it in the conversion? Two steps. Quality control. Right mm. steps, uh, I think so, and the other is um oh, in, like my, in my opinion uh, no because Lucia says uh, to re revise the step but uh, not is is talking the 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 steps it's only only says reviews but no no says the uh, the wish cuáles son los dos Mm -hmm. the, the two steps and the, and the, the question is what are two steps of the production process and so I think because it's a, a quality control maybe it's one step for me but I, I don't know yeah, quality control is a, a one step, but the 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 question said that the quality control and I think the other is the cost. The cost. No, mm -hmm. like in the cost or around a second quality. Oh, the fear, the quality control is one step, and this it will be to a second quality control. So two two quality control mm -hmm. when mm -hmm. you start and when you're finished, or when mm -hmm. you the process when the process is begin and uh, we finish the process. But Lucia said that uh, go very high, puede ser muy alto. Mm -hmm. El costo del segundo. Maybe the two is quality control. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, so the third question is what, is what did great so just about the production quality control? No, uh, control quality. Uh huh, you also uh, see now when the quality control, control quality, uh -huh, quality control. Uh, Mm -hmm. and, uh, lo que dice, the cost, the cost, or the run a second quality control. O sea, uh -huh. quality control, the quality control, y two quality control. Creo que son dos. Ajá. Son dos. No, es que le, le dice que, que ahí, o sea, es que, que se también... le puede decir cuál, es, cuál sería el costo de un segundo. Ajá, de eh, un segundo control de control calidad. Control de calidad. Sí, sería muy alto el precio, algo así. Le... Ah, entonces, estamos hablando de... Entonces sería 
Sería revision, de revisar al otro, ¿no? ¿Verdad? Okay. All right, class. Um, let's discuss the questions. Mm. We didn't finish, teacher. You didn't finish? Okay, well, whatever you have, it's okay. So what is the new product Lucia, Martha, and Greg are discussing about? They are ready, ready to start producing a new shampoo. Very good. Okay, so a new shampoo. Here's the answer. What are two steps of the production process? Remember, production, not not. Uh, production, it's production. What are two steps of the production process that uh, they mentioned in the conversation? It's a quality control. Okay, very good. So yes. Um, Quality control. Mm -hmm. What else? Quality control. The revision. Mm. Repeat once the product is finished. Finish. Uh, mm. No. It would be the revision step. The revision. Mm -hmm. The revision. Revision step. Uh -huh. Revision step. So we have the revision step and the quality control step. Okay, those are the two steps. And what did Greg suggest about the production process? Revision is set. It's new. Okay. And the number two. Mm -hmm. What did Greg suggest about the production process? Mm -hmm. Greg said that uh, reba uh, Mm -hmm. I'd like to know is the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Very good. We asked about this. Mm -hmm. Excellent. There you go. Okay. Um, all right. Okay, guys. So we have come to the end of our class. We just need to take our attendance quickly. Have your microphone ready, so you just open it up. And uh, when I call your name, also have your camera on, please, so we can see your beautiful faces. Uh, Cristina? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Good. Thank you. Annie? Present teacher. <clears throat> Mari? Carolina? Present. Christy? Jorge? Present teacher. Karen? Karina? Present. Leonardo? Present teacher. Linda? Present teacher. Marlene? I'm here. Miguel? Miguel? 
Uh, Nelson G. Present. Okay, very good. Nelson A. Present, teacher. Okay. Uh, Norma. Present, teacher. Olga. In the chat, le puso yes. algo, ah, yes, yes. I think she's having problems there. Okay, Omar. Present. Suleima Rodriguez. Present. Suleima Melgar. Present, teacher. Tatiana. Present. Ah, muy bien, excelente. Entonces, solo me quedo ahí con eh, Omar. And that would be it. I will see you tomorrow. Okay, todavía tenemos. See you class. tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye, teacher. Okay, Bye, teacher. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Bye. 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 Good night. Good night. Okay. Bueno, ya todavía está teniendo problemas con el audio. Ok. Ok. All right, Omar. Cuénteme en qué le puedo ayudar. Ok, teacher. Uh -huh. en, tengo una, una es, en base a la, a la tarea. Esto todavía no lo he encontrado. La de la tarea 3.3. Eh, la indicación es la siguiente, dice Instruction Type the indirect question Using can you tell me uh, eh, Number one Does she play tennis ¿Qué, qué debo decir ahí? Ok eh, Esa es una clase que todavía no hemos tenido ¿Verdad? Sí, Entonces pero... Eh, va a ser difícil que le pueda estar explicando todo porque aún no le hemos tenido. Eh, simplemente indirect questions son preguntas que se hacen, son más, más respetuosas. Entonces empezamos con una, eh, el comienzo de la pregunta como por ejemplo, I was wondering, do you know, can you tell me? Like when you say in Spanish, ¿me podría decir? En vez de decir, uh, por ejemplo, um, no sé, algo como, eh, ¿dónde, ¿dónde trabaja? Pregunto, ¿me podría decir dónde trabaja? Ok. okay. O oh, en vez de decir, eh, ajá. Pero, vaya, aquí le pregunta es como, ella juega tenis. Pero, ¿cómo podría decir? She, she, en este caso en específico, es que eso quisiera saber cómo, cómo armar. Es que, es como le vuelvo a decir, es un poquito difícil porque como todavía no hemos tenido la clase, um, tendríamos que esperar hasta dar la clase para que, para que sea un poquito más claro. Eh, porque si no, tendría que literalmente dar la clase. De antemano. Eh, pero sí, <risa> prácticamente, quiero ver, es la 3. ¿Qué dice? 3.3. Ok, muy bien. Y ya la tercera. Entonces dice que la instrucción es Type the indirect question using Can you tell me. Entonces empezamos con, con Can you tell me. ¿Me podría decir? Ok. Eh, entonces, mm. después, ¿me podría decir? So, everything was, todo va a empezar con Can you tell me. Andale. Okay. okay. Y después continuamos. Okay. Con Can you tell me? So, Can you tell me? ¿Me podría okay. decir? Okay, por ejemplo, ¿me podría decir qué hace usted en su trabajo? ¿Me podría decir eh, cuánto pesa usted? ¿Me podría decir, um, no sé, eh, si tiene... Eh, no sé, sí. si tiene hijos, etcétera, etcétera. Ok, ok. 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 Ahora, teacher, en la clase de ahora, es pronunciación. Tengo esto. Quiero uh -huh. entender si esto se pronuncia así. Es. Eh, um, es quality. 
or quality? Quality. Quality. Mm -hmm. Quality. Quality. Okay. Y es, en el caso dice, go very high. Es very high. Es el, el párrafo dice lo siguiente. Yeah, that's a good, a good point. Ref, Marta, what you mean? Tell, telling. Do you mind telling us? Telling, telling. Yes, telling us. Telling us. Mm -hmm. The cost to rule a uh, uh, second quality. Quality, control will, will be very high. Quality. It's quite, teacher. Control will quality. Be quality. Yeah. Control oh. will go very high. Mm -hmm. Quality control will go very high. Y el otro es este que decía ex. Y de, teacher que dice Excelsior. Excelior, Excelior. Ah, de la anterior. Sí, Excelior. Es X. Es que es como, un, como una prueba. Es, es, es correct Excelior. Is correct, Diana. The accelerator. 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 Okay. Ex accelerator. Accelerator. This is very difficult. Accelerator. Accelerator. Okay. Teacher. Accelerator. Y ese otro es prototype. Prototype. Proto, prototype. Prototype. Mm -hmm. Y este es still, still Master. ¿Qué es en español, teacher? Es solamente el nombre. Nombre de la compañía. Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. uh, y identify. Identify. Okay. Identify. Identify. Acquire. Acquire. Very acquire. Accurate. 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 Mm -hmm. Accurate. 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 Is with the sign. Acquire with the sign. Where? Acquire, acquire it with the sign. Accurate. Accurate with the design. Design. Okay. E of the hand, handling bar. Handlebar. Handlebar. Mm -hmm. handlebar, 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 things which are sandle, saddle, 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 saddle. 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 Okay, teacher, exactly. Is the Totally, 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 is Diana. Oh, totally. 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 Yes, totally. Mm -hmm. totally. Totally. Ok. Bueno, teacher, este es mi consulta. Y de ahí, pues, agradecerle la paciencia que nos tiene por... Eh, bueno, en este proceso, algunas veces este, se me hace un poco difícil 
por mi trabajo, pero eh, pues trato de estar acá. No es que me guste. Sí. Lo, 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 lo felicito porque sí, o sea, no es fácil, ¿verdad? Después del trabajo tener que conectarse y hasta, bueno, hasta esta noche y todo, pero, pero lo felicito porque hace el, el esfuerzo. Muy bien, muy bien hecho. Uh -huh. eh, sí, cualquier cosa que, que usted necesita que estemos a la orden. Acuérdese también que si usted tiene una, alguna pregunta, me lo puede escribir también eh, en, por WhatsApp, ¿verdad? Ya sea en el grupo o en mi personal. Sí. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Sí, sí porque por no, no sabía que tenía que ver. Ok, sí, excelente. Ahí estamos a la orden siempre. Ok, teacher. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, Matt. Take care. All Good right. night. Good night.